fellow believer here. I don't know if it's true. The Rudrick Forest, the legend of the shapeshifts in which, I don't know. But I definitely think it's worth checking out. Our son went missing from Rudrick seven years ago. We're still holding out hope after all these years because we heard him. It has to be the Rudrick Forest. The missing persons right there is 10 times higher than any other location in America. We should go hiking up there in those woods. Started seeing some weird shit in that forest. Hearing some weird voices, weird noises. People say there's a witch up there too. Oh no. Y empezamos a escuchar ruidos por todo sitio y y de momento todo el mundo desapareció. Me quedé solo. Esa bruja, esa bruja de verdad. This is our mom. She went missing in the Rudwick Forest. The police stopped looking for her, but we never did. He was calling for help. He sounded hurt. We tried to follow his voice, but we couldn't find him. He's still out there. He, he's still alive. What's up, believers? It's your boy Jimmy coming to you straight from the Creek Jeep here with some very exciting news for you guys. Right now, as Just we speak, we... Put it down. Nick, relax. I'm not gonna break it. <laughs> yeah, uh, that's what you said about the C100. But, but, but the, the people need to see my face in stunning high definition. We were Look at this. We're holding our entire production budget, so please be careful. I'm always careful, Nick. Anyway, as I was saying, we have tallied all of y'all's numerous votes determining where our next haunted location shall be, and the winner in a unanimous landslide victory is Rodwick Forest. And we can't wait to bring you guys along with us for more paranormal activity. But if that news was not exciting enough, Amy, should I tell them? Mm. Yeah, let's tell us. <laughs> our deal with A and E has been finalized. Yeah, big leagues, baby. Big leagues indeed, and that means you guys can expect tons more heebie-jeebie shaking, mind tingling, goosebump raising of our quest into the great unknown. All right, you know what? I think it's time to give my baby back. Come on, gently, Road trip. gently. <laughs> Scan it. Times with both of them? Yeah, both the father and the ranger are booked. <laughs> oh, but the ranger said he won't come to the cabin. Why not? <laughs> he said <laughs> uh, it's too close to the woods. Great. Well, that's more funny that we get to spend our gas. <sighs> Nick, relax. It'll be worth it. It'll be a great interview. Oh, Amy, your nose. Huh? Oh, um. Shit, Jimmy, will you give me a napkin? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Come on, Jimmy. Jimmy. Yeah, yeah. Put her seat back. Put her seat back. Put the camera down. There you go. Put it back. Grab her pillow. Got it. Here we go. I got it. Got her. There we go. Okay, we're good. We're good. Here we go. Hey, come. I thought she was taking these new meds. Yeah, so did I, man. Jeez, are you alright? I'm all right. You are. Right? Yeah, I am. Good. Yeah. We're all good. We're all good. I still think we should call Dr. Matheson. No, baby, I'm fine. I promise. Okay. I just uh, hadn't taken my pill in a couple days, but look. Okay. Okay. Do anything from inside? Please. And 
king size Snickers for you, truly. Thank you very much. Also, uh, hey, Red Bull, Nick, Red Bull, bubble gum, beef jerky, spicy, not teriyaki. I want spicy. You get one thing. <laughs> one thing. I'm the star of the show. You get one thing. Cheap bastard. Yeah, pick of the litter. Pick of the litter, and you choose this cheap bastard. He means well. You are just a mooch. That may be, but still. You okay? I think I've ever really seen you since up this early in a trip before. I was. Yeah, I, I'm fine. I promise. Okay. Mm -hmm. Good. I'm glad to hear that. <laughs> hey, have you heard back from the executives about our contracts? Oh, uh, yeah. No, they. Um, I don't know. They said something about checking with the lawyers. Uh, some lawyer shit to go. I don't know. They okay. said living in short, like, but. Just you know, that can you be. post it, okay? Yeah, yeah, I will. Jimmy, stop! I'm stop. trying to get some air. Look stop! Don't. Open your door. Wait, wait, look, 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 look! Some of my paparazzi potentially. Yeah, yeah. yeah do you blame my uh, Excuse me. Is that is that a camera? I see. Yes, uh, we are shooting for our paranormal TV show. Does that mean y'all are heading up to Rudwick Forest? Yeah. Well, let me tell you, all the rumors about that place are true. Nice. Mm-hmm. My second cousin Davis went missing up in them woods, and the police never found the body. It's like it disappeared, poof, in the thin air. Oh, that is awesome. <laughs> uh, so, Wait. thanks for talking. Uh, what channel did y'all say this is gonna be on again? Uh, well, <laughs> this is actually gonna be on A and E. Yeah. That's right. We oh are god. their newest stars. Oh my god! I'm gonna be on TV. <laughs> You're gonna be on TV a little I'm... bit. I'm gonna be on there a lot. Yeah, oh. she's in there occasionally, but not really. But yeah, you, hey, would you would you want to say our uh, a catchphrase with us. Oh my god, I would love to. What is it? Three, two, two one. one. I'm, I'm a, a believer! believer. <laughs> <laughs> I can't believe I'm gonna be on TV! My boyfriend's gonna lose his damn mind. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, man. I mean, if I could get the GPS to work, I could probably tell you where we're at. Yeah. You know, God forbid we ever go to a nice, exotic location to find these haunted places. You know, go to Fiji, the Maldives, Vegas. I'd say just a couple of miles. Oh yeah, <laughs> no big deal. Okay, go get yourself up. This guy's lost in a killer haunted forest with a witch. No big deal. Okay. Probably could be for me way out here in the middle of nowhere. Two days. We're on a budget, Jimmy. Okay. We always are. Here we go. Here, guys. I'll be right back. Okay. I didn't know that the guys from Deliverance still rented cabins to people. <sighs> Look at this. It's probably fine. Nick is always really careful about the places we stay. Right. All right. Come on, let's go. Sticks a little bit so you're gonna get All right, kitchen's on the right, you got rooms in the back. Just head upstairs in case you need some peace and quiet while you work. Got a nice view of the woods. Great. Uh, did you get the water hooked up? Yes, sir. I got you hooked up to the one out back. Now the AC acts up a little bit, but it works. So you guys are all set. Thank you. Thank you so much. What the fuck are you looking at? What? What, what the fuck are you talking about? Chase, <laughs> go wait in the truck. Apologize for my nephew. That's that's all right. We still have full access to the woods, like we discussed. Oh yes, sir. Did any of the people who went missing stay in this cabin? I don't know about missing. But some of them have gotten lost. 
So you don't believe in the witch? Look, these tourists, uh, those are people that haven't been in the woods their entire life. They come up here looking for the same haunted shit as you do. They go wandering off, they get lost in the woods, plain and simple. You can quote me on that. What's up, believers? It's your boy Jimmy here. We have arrived at the cabin. We've unpacked the gear, and now we are ready to begin our quest into discovering the country's most notorious haunted forest. <laughs> With 43 disappearances since the summer of 1968 and no bodies recovered, the authorities have no explanations to the disappearances within the forest. That's right, but many locals believe it all began with this woman, Greta Fulmer. In the summer of 1968, she abducted and killed 13 men, women, and children. And the local police found Greta dead in these woods, surrounded by her 13 victims. And next to the gun that she killed herself with was a copy of the Codex Gigas, otherwise known as the Devil's Bible. Now, ever since that summer, anyone who travels into these woods alone is abducted. Brendan Wallows, age 30, missing June 1978. Maggie Andrews, age 25, missing March 1983. Justin Haverty, November 1986. Colin Smith, Mary Furrow, Jonathan Banks. The disappearances span over the course of five decades. Right, but that all ended about six months ago. Meet Nelson Morgan. Father, Casey Morgan. They were hiking together when Casey was abducted. And this is big because this is the first and only documented case of an abduction in Rudwick involving two hikers, the only one. <laughs> We're speaking with Mr. Morgan tomorrow to find out just what happened. I cannot wait. I'm not going to be able to sleep tonight. I'm so excited. <laughs> oh my God. Well, that is all we have for now, believers. But remember, the, the cameras, cameras are, are always rolling. rolling. pump that sounded like it came from inside the cabin. Oh. 
What was it you heard? A bump. And it woke me up. And then I heard a louder bump. Sound like it came from inside the cabin. So we're outside the cabin. Yeah, we're outside the cabin. I already looked inside. And then got me out of bed for this. I just I really appreciate you it. You know, man. next Thank time you. that we're in a haunted forest with a witch, I'll let you sleep. We're okay? not even I in swear, the forest I'll let you yet, sleep man. It. it wasn't the creak of a cabin. It was a a deliberate thud, a bump. Two of them. Sorry, I just struck your slumber about that. But that's How do you know it wasn't me? Um, good. Your fat ass is asleep. <laughs> Hey, did you leave this open? Uh, no. I didn't. <laughs> oh, yeah. Oh, that's real funny. It's hilarious. Hey, wait. Yeah, that's the sound I was talking about. I told you. I wasn't lying to you. All right. Well, now you believe me. Okay, great. I'm glad I heard you crazy one time. It's the same sound that you heard before? That's, yes. Do you? Hey, you shouldn't be here. Yeah, okay. Fuck oh, yeah, come on. Ah, 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 ah. I'm going to tell your uncle to come get you. Jimmy, what's going on? This is Nick's phone. Yeah, what's up? This redneck's drunk nephew. He's drunk and he's here. All right, Chase. Hey, we had a lot to drink, buddy. Let's go sit down. You don't belong here, huh? He's in the house. You should not come. Not even. She might keep you. I keep you. All right, man, that's enough. It's time to go. Don't Let's you go. fucking touch me! She's in you. She sees you. She's here, huh? You shouldn't have come! Come on, just touch me! You shouldn't have come! Oh, 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 you get out of here! I'm really, really sorry about this. My nephew sometimes overdoes it. Clearly. I mean, we could have called the police. And I appreciate that you didn't. Uh, I'm going to get him out of your hair, all right? Be out of here. Chase. Chase, yeah, wake on. up now. We're going to go home, all right? Yeah. One foot in front of the other here. Won't happen again. Do you know? No, we're used to this. All right. You told him nothing. You're about to leave the house. Get in the truck. Shit faced. Good night.
Ooh-wee! Smells like straight gasoline. Should we find another place to stay? It's not in our budget. Maybe try to break into the house. <coughs> He's drunk. His uncle said it won't happen again. Look, we're tired. It's late. Let's just <gasps> let's go to bed and we'll try again tomorrow. We'll be fine, I promise. Wait. Wait. You guys not hear that? Hear what? Seriously. What? Listen. You're such a ass. Get up with that! Yeah. What the hell are you doing, Well, look. Wow. Ooh, uh. And mom said I had no talents. Well, no, mom right. is completely and totally wrong. Look at the <laughs> eyes and the mouth. Hey! It's perfect. Oh, and it's perfect. Sorry, so I'll put us out here, and that little guy, he's at the bottom of the totem pole. <laughs> hey, Jimmy, you yeah. ready for this interview? I really want you to press this guy hard. Yeah, man. That's what I do. I always bring him. Just trying to decide what I want to wear, you know? I'm thinking about going a little skimpy, you know? Show a little leg. Get your foot off the table. That's what the people want to see. The people do not want to see that. Dirty. They do. Sorry, I'm just going to give it to them. Hey, real quick. Let me see what I'm talking about. We're over the road. Get your hands off. Get your own mooch. Mm-hmm. Hey, what about you? Are you ready for this? Yeah. I've done this a million times. Yeah, I know. I just... I really want to do this one right, you know? We need to start this series off with a bang, and, and we really spent a lot of money on this new camera. Babe, babe. We're gonna be great, okay? What time is this guy supposed to be here, man? Okay. Um, five minutes ago, so. Think he's gonna be a no-show? I hope not. Yeah, It's kind of pivotal to our yeah. case. Probably would be, probably <laughs> pretty unreliable. That's Wait. Right. Wait, I think that's him. That's yeah, uh, over here! That's William? Yeah, okay, so this is the park ranger, he... He was the one that was on duty for Casey, right? So, how long were you a park ranger then? Seven years. And we just up and decided you wanted to quit six months ago. Right? Oh, yeah. That was around the same time Casey Morgan disappeared. That was the last straw for me. I don't know what they're trying to cover up with these woods, but I didn't want to have any part of it. So, you do believe that Nelson's daughter was taken by something supernatural? Uh huh. I mean, look, I know Nelson. He's an absolute fuck up. That's undeniable. <laughs> but to think he had anything to do with his daughter's disappearance, no. I mean, that little girl was his whole life. Uh, okay. Why then are the park rangers going through so many links to cover up these missing bodies? I mean, it doesn't make. It's the revenue. This place brings in uh, tourists, it creates jobs. I mean, listen, when hmm. I was first hired as a park ranger and I went through training, they told me explicitly never to patrol the woods alone. Huh. So you think that that's because all the people who disappeared, they were abducted while they were hiking by themselves? Absolutely. Absolutely. My partner did not want to talk about it, but they were real. So did, did you hear voices? Did you see something? Once. Oh, what did you see? My mother. <laughs> okay, you saw your mother in the forest. What the hell did she say? What, what, what did you do? Did you chase after her? Talk to her? What? I mean, no. no. Well, why the hell not? My mother's been dead for ten years. Sister, uh, Amy. Hi, nice <laughs> to meet you. Thank you for coming to see us, Mr. Morgan. 
And Mr. Morgan, uh, up there, that's that's Nick. Uh, he's the fellow you spoke to on the phone. Hey, up there. So, did you find the place okay? Okay. Okay, well, uh, we don't want to waste your time, Mr. Morgan, mm -hmm. so why don't you follow me? We're going to do the interview upstairs, okay? Just write this way. Yeah, please, Dr. I, ju I say my name into there? Yeah, yeah, right there. Just whenever you're ready, man. My name is Nelson Morgan. I'm 47 years old, and I'm of sound mind and body. <laughs> yeah, it's perfect. Uh, great, Nelson. What we'll do here today is we'll just talk a little bit. Okay, we'll get to know you a little bit, ask you a few questions, if that's okay. Yeah, okay. Good. Let's start with the morning of Casey's disappearance. Now, what brought you to Red Hook in the first place? Um, Casey loves nature. I get her one weekend a month, so we tend to spend a lot of time outside together. You were recently divorced, right? Yeah. Yeah. If you don't mind me asking, what was the cause of that separation, Nelson? I'm sorry, what does that have to do with anything? Well, we uh, were just... Um, you're the psychic. Uh, psychic is a strong word. I was actually hoping that you could help me find her. If you could contact her, help me find her. Um, that's not really how it works. Listen, Nelson, yeah. I understand. This could be really painful to relive all the details of what happened. However, we do have a lot of questions that need answering, okay? Now, the first of which is this. The police report said you waited eight hours to contact them after Casey went missing. Nelson, why would you wait so long? I, I was searching for her. She's my daughter. I'm not going to leave her out there by herself. And the police report also said that you were drunk. No, I, I wasn't drunk. You weren't I, drunk with Casey, or you weren't drunk at the police station. I'm confused. I'm... No, I, 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 I wasn't drunk. I, I had been searching for a few hours. I... I had a bottle of whiskey in the trunk of my car. I had a, a few sips to take the edge off. I, I was scared. I, yeah. I just lost my daughter. For sure, I get that now, but do you remember an incident six months ago when child services were called out to your house? I came here so you could help me find her. Not for you to judge me based on one neighbor who couldn't mind her business. I get that, Nelson, but you gotta understand, we have a job to do. We have to check our due diligence. You get that, don't you? Yeah. I need your help. I need you to help me to convince her to come home. Wait, what do you mean convince her to come home? She's still out there. What? You still think that she's out there alive? I, I know she is. I, I talked to her. Nelson, where do you talk to her? What do you guys think? I mean, he obviously believes in what he's seeing, but he's definitely troubled. Troubled? This guy's out of his fucking mind. Are you kidding me? Nick! You said this guy's alive. Are you shitting me? He seemed fine on the phone. Oh, on the phone, I see. Guys, he's not well. He's distressed. Distressed? I don't know. I feel like he's hiding something. I just don't know what it is. I know what it is. It's his daughter's dead body. Stop. I'm telling you, I have a sixth sense about this. This guy's fucking dead. Yeah. Hey! Hey, um, this, this is, uh, this is where I usually see her. Yeah. Um, okay. How long do you normally wait for her? As long as it takes. As long as it takes. Well, huh. we'll just wait. <laughs> we got nothing else to do, right? We'll just wait as long as it takes, I guess. Today, tomorrow, it's all the same. Whatever. Are you kidding me? We gotta go. We gotta get out of here. Jimmy, stop. Give him a chance. He lost his daughter. He's distressed. 
We'll give it a little time and then we'll go, okay? Hmm. Casey? Casey, baby, come on out. It's okay, baby, come here. I brought people that are gonna help. I love you, baby. Casey! I wanted her to come out. I wanted her to come home, but she just she just stands there, right? Okay. Um. Well, we've been out here for hours, so. Casey, baby, I love you so much. Maybe we just come back tomorrow and. I we'll just, just I can't do oh this anymore. No! no. Okay, Nelson. Nelson, please, 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 don't do that. Don't do that, Nelson. It's not gonna Nelson. stop. Okay, you don't know that. It's you not gonna that. stop. I do. What if Nelson? Look at me, Nelson. Nelson, Nelson. Okay. I was wrong earlier. Maybe I can help. Can, can I see the picture again? Please, can I can I see the picture again? But you can help? I think so. I, you can help. Yeah, you can I bring just, her home? I need you to put the gun down, okay? I can't. I can't. Wait, no, no, please. Please, Nelson. Nelson, give me the gun. I can help if you give me the gun. Okay, okay, okay. Let go. Please, please. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> I can't even hold this up, please, please. <laughs> I love you so much. I just want you to come home. Yeah, I've got him in the car. We'll, uh, we'll put him under a mandatory suicide watch for the next 48 hours. Okay. Does he have any family in the area, somebody that could help him? No, no, but... We've dealt with him in the past. Usually cools down after a few days. So he's done this before? Not to this extreme, but, uh, you know, he's out here in the woods all the time. He's usually drunk. He's one of our regulars in the tank. Hmm. But since you won't be pressing charges, I think I have everything I need from you. Okay. Thank you, officer. Thanks. You all take care. You too. Mm -hmm. I can't believe that. <laughs> yeah, I know. I got all that on camera. <laughs> I did. What? What? Oh, yo, Nick. Where's Amy? What? Where's Amy? I. She's outside cool. on the porch. Hey, hey, weirdo, what are you doing? I'm uh, just trying to wrap my mind around today. Oh, yeah. Want some company? Mm, are you my only option? <laughs> oh, you're so funny. Oh, no. I'm good. It's pretty much all backwash now anyway. <laughs> so creepy. <laughs> like a paranormal bloodhound or something. <laughs> Do you remember when we found that well in the woods by Grandma's house? Oh yeah. <laughs> Oh yeah, I still am trying to wrap my brain around how you convinced me 
to go down there. You were so scared. Yeah, I was <laughs> so scared because we got stuck in a well at night. We were like a real life episode of Lassie. I mean, that's not funny. <laughs> Oh my god. Do you remember what we saw? No one believed us. No. You know, sometimes I just wonder if it's all in my head, you know? I found something. <laughs> I was reviewing some of the footage of when we were out in the woods with Nelson. Okay. Put this on. Right. Okay. So you know how when he was calling for his daughter, all we heard was crickets? Yeah, yeah, nothing at all. Listen to the audio now. What? Oh my god. Yeah. What? Here. I mean, listen. listen. Yeah, you, heard <gasps> you heard it? Yeah. And you found this just now reviewing the footage? Mm -hmm. Holy shit. Are you serious? <laughs> you like that? Oh my god, this is insane. <laughs> it just continues like that the whole time we were out there, right up until we left. <gasps> Can we plug this into the camera? Yeah, man. Do fucking do it. All right. <laughs> All right, guys, so we were reviewing the footage from earlier today in the woods with Nelson, and we heard this. Casey? Casey, baby, come on out. Children. Fucking children laughing in the woods the whole time. It's okay, baby, come here. Fucking unbelievable, man. <laughs> <laughs> Hang on, believers. We are just getting warmed up. I promise you that. This is unreal. This is incredible. Yeah, it's incredible. It's fucking incredible. <laughs> we found ghosts. We found some ghosts. We're going to be famous. I'm going to be famous. That's the most important part. I'm going to be famous. Okay, so, it's 3.02 a.m., and, uh, well, I, j I just heard children laughing outside my window. Children. This place is fucking creepy. I love it. Alright, let's get going. <clears throat> What now? But I definitely heard something. I swear I heard something. Yeah, I did. I don't know. James. James? James? You out here? Oh, Amy! Amy! What are you doing? Amy! Oh shit! What? what are you doing? Ames! What the fuck are you doing? What are you looking at? <laughs> what? what are you doing to your nose, Ames? Are you okay? What? I saw her. You saw who? Casey. 
What? James, let's take a seat here. Are you okay? Probably a good neck. It's all no, right. just, just give me a wet rag to wipe the blood off, please. Yeah, all right. <laughs> hey, how did you know that the daughter was out there anyway? I thought it was a dream at first, and then suddenly I was outside. I saw Casey and I blacked out. Nelson was right. Something else is out here. Hey, don't tell Nick, okay? What? I just, he's got a lot on his plate and I don't want him to worry about me. Uh, we need to tell Nick. I mean, he's, he's gonna see this footage. Just wait know. until after, okay? Every time I get like this, he freaks out and I don't want to leave. Do you? Are you kidding me? Hell no! But this is it. I mean, this is where we prove that we're not crazy. You're not crazy. happens, baby sister, when our show is a massive success and the band breaks up because Nick back here can't handle my rise in fame, what then? Is this going to be before or after you burn out on drugs and booze, huh? <laughs> well, you know, if that was to happen, it's fine. I'll just find me one of those holistic rehab places <laughs> and, uh, you know, play with the horses and goats and everything all day long. Oh yeah? Yeah. yeah. Dream big, baby bro. Big yeah, goals do. for yourself. Yeah, okay. hey, when are those execs sending over the final contracts? It's been almost two weeks. Yeah. Uh, yeah, their uh, lawyers are looking over them, is what they said. They said that they uh, had to review the fine print. That's what they told you? That they're having their lawyers review the fine print? That's what they said, you know. How this lawyer shit goes, man. <laughs> Nobody really knows, but that's what they said, so. We'll hear something soon. Have some of that? Oh, yeah. Thanks. Shit. 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 What's wrong? I, um... I forgot my pills back at the cabin. What? It's fine. Um, I took one this morning. It's just one night. We'll be back tomorrow. Well, yep. We need it's to fine. turn back. No, it's okay. No, 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 no. Fuck that. We are not going back. We've been walking for hours. We're not going back. And what if she has Executive another seizure decision. out here We're in the middle of nowhere? Okay, can you guys stop, please? Have another seizure. I hate when you guys talk about me like I'm not here. And hey, babe, okay. I'm gonna be fine. It's just one night. Like I said, I took one this morning. I've gone longer without him and been fine, okay? Mm-hmm. And you. Time. Thanks for looking out for my well-being. Sorry. Yeah, I'm sorry. It's okay. 
I'm gonna be fine, guys, okay? Ooh, thank you. Mm -hmm. All right, looks like the GoPros are all set up. The motion capture cameras are all ready to go around the campsite. And we have full battery charge on awesome. all devices. Very good. So let's just now hope that it doesn't turn into another Connecticut. No. <laughs> Temperatures drop below freezing like every night. Yeah, that and plus uh, we didn't get anything the whole time. Hey, I tried to convince us to go, but you wouldn't yeah, listen. Yeah, I know, I know. Let's just hope tonight's a little different. Let's buckle up. That's yeah. gonna be good. Yeah. So it's 3 a.m. Amy and Nick are already asleep. I haven't seen anything yet. So I'm hoping tomorrow is a different story. All oh, this isn't for nothing. Deserve something. I don't know what it was. I definitely heard something. Holy shit. What's hey, that? We got something. What is it? I'm not sure yet. Motion sensor cameras aren't picking anything up. Whoop. Alright, I got a picture. Jimmy, you ready? Fucking ready, man. Over there. Jimmy! Get over here. What is it? Casey? Casey, are you there? Casey, it's okay. We're here to help. We're friends of your dad's. Casey? Damn, I think she's gone. 
<laughs> what? I mean, damn, are you serious? Guys, she wants to make contact. Hey, Nick, how was it gonna take the down on this shit, man? Should be ready to go by morning. I need your SD card. Uh, yeah, yeah, hold on. Woke up this morning after a great night's nice sleep to a little surprise, I guess you could say. <laughs> These things are everywhere. I don't even know what the fuck they are. Nick's viewing the footage to find out how they got here. Hopefully, we'll see that, but that's not the only surprise we had. Ames, what the hell? <laughs> what is this? It looks like an upside-down cross. Fucking awesome it is. <laughs> no, 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 this can't be happening. What's going on? It's corrupted. What is The footage, all the footage from last night. What? Uh, no, you... no, that can't be true. <laughs> yeah, it's... okay, okay. Great time to develop a sense it's of humor, It's just Nick. black and Great static, time. look. Did you take both SD cards? Yes, I did. Well, wait, 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 what about Fuck. the audio? There's nothing. It's like we didn't even turn the cameras on. Fuck! What's our battery situation like? Uh, uh, 50%. Okay, so we can stay here another night. No. Why the hell not, Nick? Amy doesn't have her meds. We don't have enough footage, Nick. We have plenty of footage. We can use what we've got from the last- No, it's not fucking enough, I'm telling hey, you. Calm down. No, listen, I'm calm. We don't have enough, Nick. Stop being a pussy. Let's stay another I'm not night. gonna risk Amy's health for more footage, all right? We can go back to the cabin and we'll come back out here. Oh yeah, because this shit, this shit happens all the time, right? Hey, it is fine. No, it's not fucking fine, Jimmy, Amy. what is going on? Look, the A&E contracts, they haven't been signed. Yeah, because okay. you said the lawyers were reviewing them. No, it's because they don't fucking exist. What? Yeah, I mean, the exec said that they weren't signing off on any new projects until we got them a pilot. You said this was a done deal. Yeah, I know what the fuck I said, Nick. You lied to us? Yeah, I lied to us, but look, we can get this, all right? And we can You're we can fucking capitalize. unbelievable. No, I'm not fucking unbelievable. Nick, get off your high horse. I'm the reason we have this opportunity in the first place, so fuck you. If you told me that this was contingent on a pilot being made, then we could have rented this equipment instead of buying it, and we could have gotten better tents. Yeah, and dra better drag our feet, you all right? Your, your MO, drag our feet, slow down. Yeah, Take I your time. Yeah, this. Okay, that's shit. enough. Jimmy, it was really fucked up what you did. Yeah. You should have told us. Yeah, I should have, but I did. Okay? Yeah. That's where we're at. You know what? Fine. I will go back to the cabin and I will get the meds. No, 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 no. I don't want you going alone. That is too dangerous. Okay, yeah, okay. so look, we all have a say in this, right? Let's put it to a vote. I say we stay. We need to leave. Of course you do. Thanks. I think we should stay. Amy, this isn't some I know, easy I know project. That it's where not. We can it's just hey, come out hey, here please. I know that you're worried, and I am fine. But Jimmy's right. This is the only chance we have to prove ourselves, to prove that we're not hacks, that I am. Please say something. This is what you want?
what do you think you're doing? Getting some water, man. No, get some out of your own pack. How fucking have you? Walk man. back to the cabin and get some from there. Real fucking mature. Yeah, real mature. You want to talk about real mature, Jimmy? How about all this shit that you just pulled out here on us, huh? Like I said I was sorry. Yeah, you are Guys, right. Guys, please. Can it. we just stop? It's over. Are you okay? Um. Yeah, it's just my stomach. Do you need anything? Um, Nick, did you get a chance to check those memory you know, cards to make sure they're Yeah, they're anywhere? fine. Jimmy, they were fine last night. Jeez, I don't need an attitude. Fuck you, Jimmy. There we go. Blame me. You always. Yeah, do. of course I'm gonna blame I'm you. If it, you hadn't pulled this shit that you did, we wouldn't be in this situation right now. All right? Awesome. This is entirely your. It's okay. It's okay. It's all right. That's pills, man. Yeah, it's not just the pills, man. It's this fucking place. But, man, I'm sorry about those contracts. I really am. It's my fault. Maybe someday you'll grow up. Here's to you, witch. Nothing we can do. There's nothing we can do until it passes. It's been over an hour, man. It's never been this long or this bad before. Maybe she just needs some rest, you know what I mean? Oh, like, she knows. She needs her meds. She needs her meds. I I'll go get her meds. You can't, man. It's, it's like she said, it's too dangerous to go alone. I know, man, but she needs him. She does, so. But you just go, you run, you don't stop for anything, all right? And then you just get those pills and come right back here. Yeah. Jimmy, get it together.
Ha, <laughs> ha, 